Hey guys, Teacher Ash here. Just wanted to come on and do a makeup get ready with me tutorial with you guys. So stay tuned. Okay, so right now all I have on is foundation. I really didn't do a lot. I just did um I just have on foundation. So I just got my little thing and I just go just like this. I don't really use a lot because I don't need it, but I just use it just so my skin looks really, really bright. And I put it right under my eyes as well. And this is my beauty blender. And I just go right under. I'm going to get my mirror. I'll use you as a mirror. <laughs> okay. So I just take it and I'll go right under my eyes. I look up and I'll go right under. Because I, I tend to have really, really dark um eyes. Dark under eyes, I mean. So, and my class is actually at 9 o'clock. It is 8, 11. So, I got plenty of time. My computer's already up. I'm just going to restart it at probably 8.30. And then go from there. So, that's it. That's what you all saw that I did with my foundation. Now I'm going to show you what I do for my face.
So this is the final look. I know some of you are looking like, what is she doing? But there's a reason why I do what I do. Like right here where I put the silver, I'm going to put, all there's a reason why I do what I do. I know it looks a little extra and I use brown eye pencil here and I use black on the corners so it can really bring out my eyebrow, if that makes sense. And then I outline my lips with black eye pencil because when I just use the lipstick by itself, it doesn't pop like how it's popping right now. Now you can definitely see my lips are different and they stand out. So um, that's that. I usually take my nose ring out right before class because um, I'm not, I don't have any regulars yet. So I don't want to wear my nose ring for a trial and, you know, they get the wrong interpretation or anything like that. So I just, you know, I don't do that. I want your makeup to pop. And the reason why this is, is because when your makeup pops, your face pops. And I put the, um, the silver in my tear dots because it makes me appear to be awakened. And I would put it, put a line here, but my, I kind of, I don't like putting makeup inside my eye, under my eye at all. And, uh, what else? Oh, the, um, the eye pencil, the black color. I use black to kind of do like a counter thing. I don't know if you can see it that much on camera, camera, but it did bring a little bit of definition to my face. So there's a reason behind that. Um, but lips, I put on two different colors. I put the um, the berry color on the outside, and I put the red, and then I put pink in the middle because it really makes my lips look natural. It doesn't just look like I put on lips. You know, it makes them look a little natural to me. So you guys might think differently, but that's what I do. Yes, I know, I know. You're like, you can wear print in your, your, your classes. It must be an orange shirt. Guys, I don't have an orange shirt yet. So this is what I do. It's a hoodie that I have. And I just tuck in the hood because the hood has print on it. And I just go from there. But I don't have any money yet to get an orange shirt. I will eventually. So eventually I'll have me an, or an actual orange hoodie, no print. But as you can see, when I do that, it takes a little bit of work. But yeah, so usually they don't see that. But I put my little flower on because it's a little different and it sticks out. So that's basically it. This is my makeup that I do for my classes. So if you like what you see, like, subscribe. I usually wear a bun. I've tried my hair down at times, but I kind of... I don't know. I usually don't do it down. And I'm and when the the actual class is going on, they won't see the blue. I'm going to show you that they won't see it. See? My hair kind of takes up some of it. And then this cord that's hanging, they're not going to see that. All they're going to see is that hello friend. I'm going to put up my Mr. Potato Head right here. If you can see him. And that's it, guys. So I hope you all enjoyed. If you have any tips, tricks, or anything that you like to use, put them down in the comment section. And of course, subscribe. Of course, subscribe, subscribe, and always subscribe. So I will see you guys next time. Until then.